you very much. I'm Max Fisher. A group of executives at music television, MTV, has commissioned my company, the Max Fisher Players, in conjunction with a team of visual effects specialists we've assembled, to produce a series of theatrical adaptations of some of this year's most outstanding films on the occasion of the 1999 MTV Movie Awards. We'll be performing, out of sight, The Truman Show in Armageddon. We hope that you enjoy the place. Thank you very much. Why do you want to have a baby with me? You can't stand me. What are you talking about? I love you, Truman. No, you don't. You never did. That's crazy. Just listen to yourself. That's insane. Stand by the cue paper boy. You're a part of this, aren't you? Cue paper boy. You're scaring me. Oh, yeah? Well, you're scaring me! Go! Do something! Do something. Who are you talking to? Think of something, damn it. Do something. What the hell is that? Something fell. It's not a light. Cue a tornado. Do it! Bring Goodbye, gentlemen. Five, Thirty seconds, Are these please. Son, we we'll make them accurate. Prepare to launch on my command. How big is it? Approximately nine million three hundred seven thousand. General, the size of Texas, sir. Son of a bitch. If I may, according to my calculations, the results of the interview. Who the hell is she? She's the smartest person in the world, General. I think we ought to listen to her. What's the prognosis, Dr. Heinsberg? The data indicates human extinction, zero percent survival, including cockroaches and bacteria. I have the president on Air Force One demanding a solution, damn it! Now what the hell are you gonna do? We're gonna blow it up, sir. But we're gonna need the best dynamite man imaginable. And just who the hell is that? Uh, don't worry, I'm one of the good guys. Who are you? I'm a U.S. Marshal. You're under arrest. You want a tussle? We tussled. Excuse me, officer. Can we borrow your car? Go. Are you scared? Of course I am. You don't seem scared. What do you want me to do, scream? No, I'm just gonna lie here. Fix it. No, I'm just gonna... No, I'm just gonna lie here and wait for you to screw up. You sound like my ex-wife. 